just wanted to come on and encourage anybody who needs it today. Um, you know, I know it's crazy times right now and there's a lot going on. I mean, in my own personal world, I've got my husband who's got some really scary health issues still and that's been going on for a year now. Um, and, you know, we're just still trying to figure out what it is. Um, and so that's scary and stressful in itself, even though, you know, we trust God and believe in God and believe that he will be healed and, um, you know, we're doing certain things to help with that process, but it's still really hard to see your spouse, your loved one, um, struggle, you know, get tired and try to struggle just walking across the room sometimes, um, especially, you know, us women <laughs> and your spouse is, you know, big, strong man, it's really hard. And, um, you know, a lot of people have lost loved ones, loved ones, um, some people are struggling with being sick right now, uh, with, you know, COVID, virus, and I know people who have other things. It's just a scary time to be sick in general right now. You know, who wants to go to the hospital during this? And um, that's even with my husband, you know. He didn't want to have to go to the hospital because at the hospital you have to keep a mask on the whole time and you don't feel good. And you're like wearing your mask and, and then you don't want to come out, you know, go to the hospital and then you end up worse off than you were when you went because now you've got a virus. <laughs> It's just, I don't know. And then you can't even have your loved ones there with you. So, um, there's just so much stress in the world right now. On top of that, you know, just seeing your kids um, not fully be able to be kids right now. It's <laughs> a lot. Um, you know, maybe losing your job, struggling to pay your bills. It's just a lot. That's all I can say. But also, there's a lot of good, you know. You've got the ones that you do have that you love in your life. Um, you've got your own life, your breathing and um just to trust in god that he's there helping you get through it and that everything will be okay uh you know and that you'll make it through and things will get better and so i just wanted to encourage if anybody else is having a hard time and let you know that you're not alone and that you're loved and that you can say a prayer and talk to God. And if that's not your thing, <laughs> then hey, sometimes look in the mirror and talk to yourself and we'll pray for you. So that's it. That's it for today. I was going to try to do a post about my business, but I'm really having a hard time talking about that right now. There's just so much other things going on. So, but I will say that I am really happy with um, this new business that I'm doing and the team that I'm on they're very supportive um, it's really a focus of building a better future for our families where we're not having to buy a bunch of products 
um, have a bunch of products on hand, put in a bunch of our time um, and effort. Uh, instead, we're making videos and blogs that will do all the work for us in the near future. Not today, although some, some of us are benefiting today, <laughs> but our goal is a little bit longer term than that, like a year, two years out. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be uh, really what the dream is of having your own business that's residual income, which means money that you're making even in your sleep. I need that. I need something that I can have, you know, if I have to take care of my husband or my kids or myself <laughs> or if um, I lose my job again or if um, I get older and tired of the day-to-day -day hustle. So, I'm doing this for those reasons. So even when I don't feel like doing it, I'm doing it anyway. I'm pushing through. Even if I only can do one little tiny small thing, like make a little video that is probably not that great. <laughs> it's better than nothing and it will pay off. Doing something is always better than doing nothing. So, that's it.